this one over here will be our bedroom, for example. And uh, we can add as many. Do we, have to, do we have to share a bedroom? Damn, son! <laughs> I'm a grown man. I don't share a bedroom. <laughs> okay, fine. Greetings, Cyber Dogs! This is Ren Dog coming at you from this Let's Play Minecraft Ticket series, and I'm here with my brother from the same freaking mama, Real Gox. Say hello, Real Gox. I can't make it to the top, man! Ah! <laughs> it burns! It burns! <laughs> and welcome, guys, to this Let's Play Minecraft Ticket series. And in the previous episode, we were. Man, I can't even remember what we were doing. What were we doing, Goxy? Um, hey, can I have some of that fish? Yes. <laughs> no, don't worry about it. No, don't worry about it. Um, what were we doing? I don't know. It was quite a while back. We had a we had some family business in between, and that's why uh, there's been such a delay. Oh, I know. We were exploring the giant ravine. That's what we were. Uh, and since okay. then, guys, you can see that a whole bunch of crafting has been going on. And in the distance there, you can see that our, the island is not really looking like the island no more. It is looking kind of weird, and we're going to go over across there now to, to explain to you and show you exactly what we've done. And by the way, Goxy has been working on the, the wheat farm by himself, and I haven't seen it yet. So this is going to be a surprise for both me Dude. and the Yo, side. Oh, the wheat farm is so awesome. Oh, it gives me chills just thinking about it. <laughs> Man, let's get okay, over so, the so, so one of the comments that we got was some dude, and... I'm sorry, I don't remember all the names and stuff, but some dude said, why don't you make a, a bridge across the water from the starting island? And uh, that's what I've done. So thanks, mystery guy. Yeah, man, that was a sweet suggestion, guys. And if you have any suggestions for us, we read all the comments. So freaking leave your comments in the, in the comment section below. And you better remember to subscribe or Goxie and I are going to freaking kick your asses. You bastards. Okay, so let's head to the, the, okay. the wheat farm. Take us through. What Get ready for your mind to be blown. Okay, now I don't know if you guys Whoa. remember, but none of this actually existed before. We built this entire island. Oh, oh man! What? <laughs> yes. What is going? What is freaking going on here? What the hell? <laughs> what the freak is going on here? Where's the wheat? Okay, so <laughs> this is this is the uh, the farmland. So what I read was that. Uh, the plants don't grow at night unless you put light sources around them and then they do grow. So this is why I've built this weird kind of like tortoise shell thing with all these torches because... Um... Ah. Okay, so then the other thing as, about as wheat As the farming... architect, I approve of this Sweet! Design. So then the other thing is that you need... I don't know if you remember the old wheat farm. It had like a whole bunch of water everywhere because I thought that to get farmland to be moist it needs to be next to water, but it actually just needs to be within four blocks of water. Oh, so that's why... Ooh, okay. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to throw you some some seeds. Um, and we can begin planting. Yes, where did you get all these seeds? Just plant, man. Plant like crazy. But yeah, um, guys, we, wanna, we also want to address something uh, while we're planting these seeds. Um, most of you guys realized that we needed to use bone meal on grass to make um, seeds, and we didn't realize it. And there's a whole bunch of you that, that I mean, this is the only way this uh, wheat farm is made possible, is by bone bone mealing the grass. So, and, and you we basically feel, we feel made like this buttholes. episode not lame and uh, stagnant. <laughs> and uh, we feel like buttholes for not actually, and you know, after 89 episodes of, of uh, my Let's Play Minecraft series, you would think that I would know that. But, uh... <laughs> Apparently not, and <laughs> um, a couple of the cyber dogs, Goxie, I want to tell you a, a funny story, have um, put together, uh, <laughs> basically, the, it, basically they're called Guide to Being a Noob by Rendog. Uh, they've, basically <laughs> they've basically written guides about how bad I am at Minecraft um, from my other Yo. series, and man, it, they're brutal, but damn, they're true. I'm a freaking noob. <laughs> But anyway, th okay, so we, we ha have you got see, any seeds see. left? I'm done. I'm no, done that's with it. All the seeds. Okay, so what happens is when the wheat is, is golden, you got to wait for it to be golden and delicious. Mm, then damn. then you, harvest, you harvest it with a scythe, and then it drops wheat and seeds, and it drops more seeds than 
But if you harvest it while it's still green, then it, it has a chance of dropping seeds, but it doesn't drop wheat. So you have to literally wait for everything. Well, they are going, it's going pretty quickly over here. So this is sweet. Yeah, it, it, it ta it'll take about, I think, two sunsets. Ah, sunset. the OCD is kicking in. We need to finish it. Ah. Okay, but check it out. Check it out. Okay, in the beginning, remember, I was going to be the farmer to supply the, the food. Yes. And I've been pretty much the worst farmer um, in the history of uh, farming. Yes, I would, I would like, agree. If I played Agricola, I got like one point. So, yeah, yeah. to make up for it, have some bread. And some Damn! more bread. Damn! Yes! Yeah. <laughs> so 128 bread on a 95 And I've got 64. Mm, Damn! Yeah. Sweet. That means, so, yes, that means we, have got, we have got bread for a very long time. So basically, yeah, we don't, we're going to still get, like, get malnutrition because all we're going to eat is bread, but at least we have food. Yeah, all right, food. Good work, man. I, I approve of this farm, and I'm sure the cyber dogs too, guys. Let us know what you think in the comments below. Um, but I think this freaking farm gets a huge thumbs up. Man, that is sweet. I'm digging this design over here. Mm. Yeah, it looks no. cool, eh? Now, Let's take them okay, through what all so this white crap is because they're yeah, probably the looking hell? at this crap over here and thinking, what the hell is going on here? Guys, this... Okay, wait, wait. What? Ch Everyone, I don't know if how good the, the videos are on YouTube, but look at the mini-map. The mini-map gives you a good picture, like, oh, overall view. I actually, ha this, I actually hadn't looked at the mini-map yet. Look at the mini-map, people. Wait, let me press the period key. Let's even get a bigger... There we go. Okay, that is awesome. We can see... Now you can see the bridge to the, the, the spawning um, continent as well as what's going on here. Now, guys, what I've always wanted to build as a kid is a secret laboratory because my brother and I used to watch Dex Dexter's laboratory all the time. And man, all I've ever wanted was a secret laboratory. So I've decided to build one here. And as you can see, this is a laboratory made up of five pentagons, right? Goxie, they're pentagons. Uh, uh, one, two, possibly. three, four, five, six. No, they're octagons. They got eight sides and they are all connected symmetrically and the, the laboratory is completely symmetrical and each one of the the cells of this laboratory is going to be something different so like the middle cell is the the, the, the entrance and then this cell close mm. to the wheat farm will be like the storage room and then this cell yeah. close and to we're going to have an engine room to, to generate power for everything this room and will like... probably be the engine room because it's going to be powering the quarries um, underneath here and then this one over here will be our bedroom for example and uh, we can add as many. We have to, do we have to share a bedroom? Damn, son. <laughs> I'm a grown man. I don't share a bedroom. <laughs> okay, fine. We'll have each of our own Oh, bedroom. maybe we can make bunk beds. No, dude, let's make uh, bunk beds. Yeah, let's make bunk beds. And we, we definitely need to make our bedroom have a view of the volcano. That's for sure. Yes. Okay. So nice. this is the laboratory, like guys. It. And basically, we're going to be working on this. We, we will work on it um, on camera. We will be crafting this together. But we'll probably do some work on it off camera also. So, um, But we're definitely going to gonna do a huge craft. Probably three or four episodes of building this sweet-ass laboratory once we've got our quarry going. As I understand it, Goxie, you've found something sweet underground. And um, yeah. you won't tell me what it is. Oh, man. Dude. Okay, yeah, yeah, actually I can mention um, another comment that keeps coming back is that Tekkit is designed to have like crazy big underground labyrinths. And man, Goxie, tell me what the hell is going on in all of these chests over here? Damn! I just, uh, I'm just reorganizing. Okay. Ah, damn can it, I, I made two iron leggings. Okay, so here's That's a whole bunch of emeralds and stuff. That's sweet. Yes! This is Nicolite for, for Africa, man. Ridiculous amount of redstone, lapis lazuli. Yes, Goxie has been busy getting busy. Damn. Yeah, so basically all I did was I collected all the stuff that we, we had and put them... I was bored, so I put them in like their own chests. Okay, sweet. Sweet. Um, we're probably going to have to move because my, at some point. Yeah, no, we definitely will. So what my plan is, is to have one chest that we dump all of our... So just say we go like... Um, hey man, I want this uh, Freddy Krueger mask. Damn it. Have you seen yourself? Go... Damn. <laughs> <laughs> just say we go gallivanting down a cave and you have like your whole inventory full of crap. Yeah. I want there to be one chest that we just dump everything in and then that chest gets... The, the items get pumped out into a massive sorting rig and get stuck into individual chests. So like all diamonds would go into one chest, all iron would go into one chest. You can even do stuff like all iron ore goes into a furnace 
And once it's smelted, it gets pumped into an, uh, an iron chest, like fully automated. So that's kind of my end goal. That is, that is sweet. Okay, so we've both got some armor on. Yeah. Um, and now it's time to freaking... Oh man, I, but I've got such rubbish tools. Wait, I want to make... Do you have any sweet tools for me? Like, no, I, I just like made some. Tools. I just made a whole bunch. No. Give me some iron pickaxes, damn it. Oh uh, yeah, no, I do, I do. Yeah. I've got the yeah. butthole of all items. The stone pickaxe. Actually, it's the second butthole. The wooden pickaxe is the butthole of all items. Oh, and there were also comments um, about people explaining how to make charcoal. Oh, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. And it turns out you can use wood, like raw wood, to make charcoal. So thanks for that. So that is definitely something I'll be doing because apparently this chews up a lot of uh, coal, like all of these. Yeah, so um, a lot of people have been saying um, that we need rubber. And we, the whole series is like never going to float because we don't have rubber. And guys, um, that is true. We don't, for industrial craft, we don't need rubber, but for, for one of them we do. I know that one mod does need rubber. And we're going to eventually get to that mod. It's more complicated, so we're going to first do the one that we can do first. And then um, I promise you we will go find rubber. It's going to happen. So just take it easy. We will find the freaking rubber. What we're going to do is we're both going to build boats and just sail off until we find like something because we have both tried and uh, we just need to dedicate more. We've basically gone a thousand five hundred clicks in all directions and found nothing. <laughs> do you have but torches? I think what we should do is way. go like. Oh no, I don't. Okay, Crap. where where have you where where have you put the coal? I I don't. Oh, uh, they might. They maybe in the furnaces. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I'll make some. Okay, here's some. Here, here's eight sticks. Now I've got a butt ton of sticks. Okay, sweet, man. And I think what we're going to do is probably work on the, the box room first, the storage room first, so that we can start organizing um, all of our stuff. Because w what the quarry is going to do is it's going to start sucking up blocks in a, in a, in a square. And then we, we will be able to redirect uh, certain block types, as Goxie was saying earlier, into different um, chests. So the sooner we can get like a really organized box room set up, um, the better. Yeah, yeah. But the problem is that it, okay. it takes a lot of piping. Um, so we have to plan it with the piping in mind. So we might even need to dig under the floors and stuff. I'm not quite sure yet. Okay, sweet. So let's but get anyway, down so, into the freaking dungeon. Yeah, so while I was busy collecting minerals, I came across... Man, it was just so sweet. I'm not going to give any spoilers because... I just have to try and remember how to get there. It might be a long day. I think it's this way. Uh, ah, yes, it's down here. Yeah, this looks like a new shop. Um, yes, yes. Me and the Cyberdogs haven't been this way yet. Yeah. So I was just basically trying to get iron because I, I died and I lost all my iron arm and I'm just wasting it. Okay, so... So... Tech it is all about giant caverns, so we've realized this, right? Uh -huh. Okay, I think it's this way. Man, there's a whole bunch of stuff you didn't you didn't mine around here. I know, I know. But check it, check it this. Check it this shit, man. Look at this! What the hell? <laughs> what the freak? This is a giant freaking... Oh my... Oh my god. Look at this, dude. Is this, this a is a giant like... reservoir of oil? Is that what this yes. is? Yes. Exactly. Ow! So we basically hit the Saudi Arabia the of Minecraft. Of tech come, come, come dive into this oil. What the hell? It, it, this is, it acts this, like water, right? This can't be normal. Guys, no, is dude. this normal to find such ridiculous reservoirs of oil? What? Just jump in oh here, my right? God, it gets bigger. Look how, look how deep it is. It is so deep. Oh <laughs> my god. You, you do realize uh, that every single Tekken nerd that's watching this show just had a nerdgasm. <laughs> because this yeah, is. Yeah, so I, I looked at this and absurd. I was like, wow. So, <laughs> this is an absurd I, amount of I oil. I think there's also more here. You know, the, actually, the, I'm not sure. I'm gonna. But I'm, anyway, what the hell? <laughs> there's squids in here. <laughs> there is oil a squid, squid in this oil. Dude, you you are in the wrong. <laughs> you're in the wrong business over there, buddy. <laughs> and there's so many resources down there, also. Okay, well, um, 
because I was worried that the oil um, outside of the, the island wasn't going to be enough to, to enough fuel for yeah. our quarry. But um, I'm pretty much sure that this is now going to be enough fuel for a very long time. Goxy, this is, this is honestly like one of the most exciting things I've seen in Minecraft in like a year. The, this is ridiculous. Now you know what it's like when you like when oil barons go to Saudi Arabia and like dig into the ground and then suddenly a jet of oil s like spurts <laughs> into the sky. They're just like ding 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 ding, mother load. <laughs> okay, well, well, I mean, this is ridiculous. We need to get we need to get freaking going, man. We need. Yeah. To, why don't we dig so, above? Why don't we dig above this oil to yes, see where yes. it comes up and then? Um, no, we don't have to dig above. We just need to go to the center and um, remember the coordinates. Oh, okay. Or look so on your mini map as well. Okay, show show me um, show us how you've been doing this because you've been getting really good at this. So guys, if you want to figure out how to find stuff beneath the surface. Oh no ways! What what? Come come swim up here. Swim up where? Is there a little hole here or something? There's a hole. What? And and come look where it oh look where what? it ends up. Oh, it's actually the oil geyser. Yes, it's the oil geyser. We found the base of the oil geyser. Yeah. This is Ah, I'm drowning! Just keep on swimming. <sighs> Holy crap. That is the coolest freaking thing that is that is the best. <laughs> So this little pimple we thought was just, it's just like the, the tip of the iceberg. Oh my god, that is so, that is the most awesome of awesome. So basically I, th this, <laughs> over here, this segment of the laboratory is going to be the, the pump room, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, I, I mean... Think, I think we should eat some bread in celebration. Okay. Woo! Damn! Mm. Nom 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 nom. Mm. Nom nom. Mm. <laughs> Yes, yeah, man. So awesome. when and I saw that, man, okay, so, I had an orgasm. So, Goxy, so we've got oil, right? Yeah. We've got lava, which we also need. Yeah. What do we need the lava for? Let's let's explain. Um, so one of the, the mods has engines that create power, right? It's kind of like the theme. Um, and to, to run the engine, you've got to put in like an energy source. So that can either be coal or saplings or anything that burns or you can use um, oil or f uh, fuel, which is refined oil, or lava. So it's actually just like a source of energy. That is sweetness. That is the sweetness. And you can pump it uh, and store it in tanks, I believe. So we might actually just have like a lava pumping rig okay, next so, to the oil pumping rig. Okay, so, Goxy, I reckon, okay, so let's explain. Come have a look to... at the wheat farm. Have a look at the wheat farm. Oh, it's blossomed. Okay, so yeah. let's let's explain to um, the the the, guy, the people who are new at Tekkit or who have never played Tekkit exactly. Yes, this is looking pretty. It's cool, eh? The wheat texture is so sweet in this texture pack. Yeah. Um, okay, so guys, I'm quickly going to explain to you Tekkit noobs out there exactly what the hell, why we're so excited about this oil, right? Basically, what we're going to be doing is pumping this oil into an oil um, container, right? It's going to be like a giant glass container that holds the oil. We're then going to be using that oil to power uh, a machine that's called a quarry. And the quarry yeah. digs block by block like this, and it, it sucks up the block. And then we can and use pipes to out. redirect the yeah. blocks that the quarry sucks up into the boxes that, uh, of our choice. And the quarry will dig all the way down to bedrock. So yeah. um, that is, that, that is why, why we're so excited, because that, that is probably enough oil to... Yeah, uh, yeah. The, the reason we're excited is because, like I was explaining about the energy, um, a quarry requires like a butt ton of energy. And, it, um, and oil So you're either spending up, right? your whole life digging coal and like throwing it into the quarry machine. Well, actually, you don't put it in the quarry. You, just, you have to power the quarry with engines. So you're throwing it in your engines. Yeah. Or, and, and unlike or you can water, just use the oil. Where you can make an infinite water source, you can't yes, make an you infinite can't. oil source, and your quarry yeah. uses up the oil. So. Um, yeah. The more oil you have, the better. Uh, the, the, the bigger quarry, quarry you can, can actually run for. So damn, that means we are freaking. Oh man, we are we are so close to actually just building the quarry now. Um, you know, we we've got everything that we need to make the the quarry the well to make some of the, so. the, the the bits of the quarry, right? Yeah. Well, I mean, j just check in your your item recipe book. Let's actually just see what 
What okay, I'll tell needs. you what. I'm going to pick up some of this marble so that I can um, build the walls of this cell. Why don't you go and collect all the the materials that we need to, to, to produce the quarry? Yo, you need diamond gears, diamond pickaxe. Diamond gears, gear. diamond pickaxe. And to make one gold gear, I mean diamond gear, you need four diamonds. So in, all together, we're going to need eight plus this three in the pickaxe, 11. Okay. We're going to need diamonds, man. We need freaking diamonds. Okay, how many diamonds do we need in total? 11. Um, 11, and that's... Yeah. Okay, okay, so we need 11... We, but we that's need 11 just for the diamonds. quarry, I think. Yeah. But um, I think also what I want to do for all the viewers is give a little demo. You can come and learn. Learning is fun with Uncle Goxy. <laughs> and um, I want to just do like a demo of how you can pump items from one chest to another chest. Okay, that sounds sweet. So yes, that, let's that do is, that in uh, this episode. Well, let's. I don't think we, we're going to have time, unfortunately. Oh, okay. how, how much but, time um, do we have left? Probably zero minutes. Damn it! <laughs> but, um. Yeah, so. <clears throat> I think you should make it so that the people can see. So, why don't you make some. Um, what we need is a wooden pipe. Uh -huh. And we need a cobblestone transport pipe. And then a, a pump. Hmm. So just check in your recipe how to make all of those. And you tell me what you need. And I'll uh, collect them from here, here, these chests. Okay, so what do I need again? What are we making? We need a... Oh, God. There's okay, so much need... stuff. Okay, here we go. Here are the pipes. Oops. Yeah, so go wooden transport pipe. Okay, so I found a wooden transport pipe needs... Uh, a w wooden plank, a, a piece of glass, and a wooden plank, right? And a cobblestone okay. transport. No, wait, no, just needs... wait, just wait. Okay. So I'm gonna throw you that shit. Okay. And uh, you craft it. Okay, so guys, this is a transport pipe, right? So this is the inside this pipe we're gonna be transporting um, stuff. So I'm making. Just, just make own... one, eh? Don't, don't make a lot. Must I make you cobblestone? A cobblestone. One. Um, yeah, if you have, just make like one set. Okay, guys, so... Uh, but I need more wooden planks. I need more wooden planks. No, you, what? To make the wooden transport pipe. Uh, okay, I need to go punch a tree with my fists quick. So basically, um, the, ow, beginning, ow, ow, the, ow. the beginning of a pipe needs to be wood and the end of a pipe needs to be wood, right? No, 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 no. Okay, let me explain how it works. When I first looked at it, I was very intimidated because there's like so much crap, right? But each pipe does a different thing. Um, and that's why I just want to start simple and then we, we can make it more complex as we go. So if you want to pump something out of something, okay, you so use a wooden pipe, uh, right? So wood is out so of if you something. Wanna, Yes, wood is out. So if you want to pump like something out of a furnace or out of an automatic build table or out of anywhere, out of a tank, if you want to pump oil out of a, a, a glass tank, you've got to use a wooden transport pipe. But if it's liquid, then a, a, a waterproof one, right? So wood is to, to pump shit out. And you connect the pump directly to the wooden pipe. Okay. Then you have, then you have cobblestone and stone pipes which are just literally like a path they don't do anything except they are your pipe and the reason they are different is because they don't join together so if you want to put two pipes side by side if you make all of them cobblestone then they will all join together which is not what you want if you want two separate lines you got to use one cobblestone oh one stone. that make oh right. i see so you can make lines run next to each other without joining yes because it's very it's very space consuming Okay. Then you get a redstone one where as soon as an item goes through it, it sends a signal. Right? Okay. Then you get gold one, a gold one that um, accelerates an item so you can speed things up going through the pipe. Oh, uh, that's cool. An obsidian one sucks items up so you can throw an item at it and it'll suck it up into uh, the pipe. Oh, that's cool. That's really cool. And the the most useful one is the diamond one which sorts items but it requires a butt ton of diamonds okay um but that is the one obviously that um is the coolest because you can actually build like a sorting machine okay sweet so have you got a couple of chests there or... 
Yeah. Let me why don't we check. Why don't we do okay. the demo in the white room? This is the this is the the crazy room. <laughs> okay, but we still need to build. Um, we still need to build the pump. Okay, so let, let give me all okay, the chairs so, to build the pump. Okay. okay, so we now we need to build a pump, right? Yeah. Okay, so, so no, no, sorry, not a pump, an engine. An engine. Yeah. So let's go to go to your little search thing there and uh -huh. go engine. So now you get three types of engine: a redstone, steam, and combustion. They all produce different different amounts of power and can. Um, are used for different things. So a redstone engine pretty much can only pump items out of things. It can't pump oil. Um, it doesn't like. It's not really that powerful. And but it doesn't need fuel. A uh, combust a steam engine needs fuel, so you'd have to put coal in it. But it can do anything. And yeah, a combustion engine. engine. Yeah, a combustion engine. You have to put in fuel and water, and it makes the most power. So. We'll use those in a later stage, but just focus on the, the redstone one. Okay, hold on. Okay, so we're going to be building the, um, the just the simple redstone engine, yeah, right? Yeah, just the redstone one, yeah. Okay, so okay, for the so redstone the... engine, we need three wooden planks, a piece of glass, a wooden gear, a piston, and a wooden gear. Yeah. Okay, so we have glass and we have wooden planks, I think. Okay, I need to go punch that tree a bit more. Okay, so but uh, you make the maybe make the piston. I've got wooden planks. I've got wooden planks. I do. Yeah. All so right. the piston's easy. We all know how to make a piston, right? It's three bits of cobblestone on each side, uh, a wooden plank in the middle, and um, an iron a redstone bar. Bit. Oh no, a redstone yeah. bar uh, at the bottom. Now a wooden gear is just very easy. It's just four um, wooden sticks. So I'm going to make all that jazz, right? Because I've got sticks. So I'm going to make two okay. wooden gears that's what we need to make um, the engine so one wood one wooden gear two wooden gear and now um, cobblestone we're gonna be it's three cobblestone on each side like this because we're making a, a, a piston it's a can you throw a piece of redstone at me please redstone coming up and a piece of iron man it's gonna be so awesome when I have my sorting machine damn it's gonna be sweet okay so the piston has like you know um, the, the plank at the top. It's and then it, it needs redstone to power it, and then it needs a, a piece of iron, which is the pole in the middle. So, oh no, wait, I did that wrong. <laughs> <laughs> this is going to go in the the how to be a noob at Minecraft diaries. <laughs> <laughs> wait, why isn't this working? Huh? Why isn't this working? Ah, I know. Plank, plank, plank what we need to do here <laughs> there we go piston baby mm. okay now what we need to do is make the engine right okay do you need a piece of glass I need a piece of glass but not an ass <laughs> okay yeah. so we need plank 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 Bam. glass gear Just piston gear right so have you so, got everything there plank 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 glass Gear, piston, gear, redstone whoop. engine, bam! Whoop, whoop. Sweet! I'm gonna do the redstone engine dance. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> uh, wait, 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 wait. Check, check, check. What? Woo! <laughs> <I'm>... <laughs> it's, it's hey, does it look like I'm? Does it look like I'm juggling? I think I'm gonna juggle bread. Actually, I'm just picking okay. bread. <laughs> okay, okay, sweet. Anyway. So now we have the now we have the uh, the redstone engine. But guys, we have run out of freaking time in this video. Yeah, and, we're even uh, over time. We're way over time, so we're gonna have to end this video here. But in the next freaking video, we're gonna be showing you how to make an item go from one chest into another chest, and that's gonna be the first freaking ticket thing that we build, man. And it's gonna be sweet. And um, if you guys have enjoyed this episode, please hit the freaking like button. And if you haven't subscribed yet, you better subscribe. I'm going to put this freaking engine between the crack of your ass. And this has been Rendog and his brother from the same Mama Real Dogs playing Minecraft Tekken. Guys, we'll see you in the next video. Say goodbye, Real Dog Tech. See you later, guys.